Hello and welcome back to the channel today. We're reviewing Wester Limited Edition Pineapple Rum. So, welcome back to my channel, Legends. Thank you for watching me today. Today, we're going to be looking at this stuff. It is Wester Spirit Co. Pineapple Rum. Now, this is distilled in Scotland. It is limited to 1,000 bottles. Right, guys? Um, so, it's an interesting thing to review. It's something that I didn't really think about. It was sent to me by a viewer called Dr. J, so thank you, man. I appreciate you sending me a little Christmas present. Um, I'm going to read you the little blurb they give you. It says, not your average rum. We macerate fresh pineapple in our pot, still vapor infused through pineapple skins, then infuse the spirit with dried pineapple. These three methods bring their own unique character to the rum. Nothing added, just pineapple and rum. Now, one thing I want to show you is that there's a, let's come around, just get up close to the camera is there is like a bittiness. Um, some of that is bubbles, but some of that is like a bitty sort of texture in the in the rum. So I just wanted to run round and show you that, guys. Um, I've never had any pineapple rum before, so this is a new one for me. Uh, the bottle's sealed. Really well packaged as well. I want to recommend that. Um, I do not... I need a knife. Yeah, so you can see it back to the packaging, it was really well packaged. It had like, it was in like an airbag almost, to like protect it. Um, which I was really, really impressed with, to be honest. Um, I can't get it open, it's so, like they've been careful with it, if that makes sense, because it's maybe because it's limited edition, I don't know, but it's like a plastic seal around the, the top of the bottle and it's very tightly on there. So just for the alcohol content it is 40%, it is a 20 centiliter bottle guys. Um, let's get it open. I don't know about the smell of that guys, if I'm, if I'm, I want to be very direct and transparent with you guys at home. I'm not too sure about how this smells. It smells potent. I was expecting with it being pineapple there to be some sort of sweet um, flavor going on. There is not. It is just purely, purely like nasty smell. Um, so yeah, I'm not a fan, but <sighs> smells like it's gonna knock me out if I drink it. It's actually about me gag, I've not even drunk it yet. Um, it might be really nice to drink. It just smells a bit wrong. Um, I was gonna try it without lemonade, then try it with lemonade. I think I'm gonna reverse those rolls, guys. And I'm gonna put a dash of that in there with some lemonade to try first. Just to, just to, literally, I'm making a small portion, guys. Um, if you buy lemonade, it must be Schweppes, guys. All right, can't be drinking any lemonade that isn't Schweppes. Um, little bit of the bubbly going in the top. Um, that still does not smell good. Oh, I tell you what. That's actually really nice. You know when they say you should never judge a book by its cover? That is a book not to be judged by its cover. It's like a, 
sweetness underneath the rum, um, which I've not really experienced with rum before. Um, it's got like a sweet undertone that just comes through as you drink. And it's genuinely very nice. I'm very, uh, well, you saw me smelling it. I was, I was nervous. I was nervous. I splashed it on my head. Um, that is actually incredible. Um, I cannot believe how good this stuff is. Um, I'm speechless, to be honest. With, with lemonade, I could sit and drink, especially in the summer. Sit and drink that all day. Now I don't know if I dare drink it on its own because the smell's just wrong. I'm gonna I'm gonna have a swig on its own just so I can review the product for you guys sat at home. If you want me to have a swig, like the video right now. Do you know what? It's very nice. Um, now for a, for a spirit which is 40%, that was so, so smooth going down. Um, it is only a little bottle and it is a limited edition, so I don't want to just sort of guzzle it down for the hell of it. Um, it's got a smoothness to it and a sweetness, but also kind of like a little sort of, um, you know what that... You're gonna kill me here, guys, but you know that little sort of pineapple on pizza, sort of like, like that sort of like, like that kind of like, like that feeling in your mouth after you have a slice of pizza with pineapple on, where you just kind of look at it and it feels amazing in your mouth. That's the same sense you get when you drink this stuff neat. Um, to be honest with you, I was I was dubious when I smelt it. Um, because when I smelt it, I got doubts, but there was no need. There was no need for any of the doubts, any of the anxiety, any of the fear. The stuff is really, really good. And I want, I want to be clear about that as well, guys. Um, I don't know how they've done it. Um, it's, in terms of drinking it, it's got that same feel of a, a fine sort of malt whiskey. You know you drink a, a fine malt whiskey and it's 40% but you don't know it's 40% because it just it just flows into you. They've done that with a rum and I've never ever ever had a rum where it's smooth and it tastes smooth. And I drink a lot of rum, especially navy rum is my preference, not the light stuff. Um, but this has got a smoothness to it, like nothing I've ever, ever, ever drunk in my whole entire life, guys. I can't tell you what, it's, it's, it's amazing. I'm, I'm, I know I'm rambling, but I'm so impressed with this stuff. Um, especially when you think about how it smells. It, it's just blown me away. Um, so yeah, West the Spirit Co. I sincerely, sincerely, seriously recommend you guys check these out because that was very special. Um, with lemonade as well, it was just a tremendous drink. And um, I don't know what to give it out of 10 because I am primarily a whiskey or bourbon drinker. Um, as most of you know, Jack Daniels is my drink of choice, guys. But for this is very special. And it's the best rum I've had in my life. That's clear. It's, it's a special bottle of stuff. And I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10 because it has such a flavour to it. And I can't describe the flavour, it's like a sweetness. And the way they've managed to get that into a bottle of rum and for it to still be 40% AV, ABB, that shocks me. Um, the, the smoothness and the sweetness of this reminds me 
of like a 15 to 20 percent bottle of sweet gin that's what it reminds me of how sweet and smooth this is to drink so i cannot recommend this highly enough it's definitely one of the best things i've ever ever had to drink um like i say they're limited edition and they're not like huge bottles they're small bottles i think because it's a limited edition product um it's like a one-off so i don't think they're obviously going to make the massive bottles that's how limited edition um food and drink does tend to be make sort of keep you wanting more um, i would definitely check out other stuff this company makes um because it's fantastic and you can tell love and care has gone into making that so i really really enjoyed it nine out of ten now thank you guys yes you my legends for watching today um appreciate you being here this video is going up around New Year's Eve. So if you don't see me on New Year's Eve, I hope you have a wonderful 2020. And also guys, if you could drop a little subscription down below, that would help me out because I'm trying to hit 250 subscribers. That's the next thing I've got my eye on. Um, we're at 229 when I film this, it could go up or down since, so, you know, we might be at 250. If I'm at 250 when you watch this, thank you. But if not, guys, subscribe, help me out. Like, let's get, let's get as many people watching the channel as we can. Share it with your friends, especially if you've got friends that like rum. If you've got friends that like rum, send them this link and show them this stuff because it is genuinely the best rum I have had in my whole life. Um, and again, thank you. To the founder of the feast, Dr. J, for sending me stuff and donating as you do. It means so much to me, man. And all there is left to say is, I will see you real soon. Thanks so much for watching today, guys. If you've enjoyed that, you can click up here and you can watch another video of mine. Or if you really love it, if you really, really love it, or even if you just like it a little bit, go down here and subscribe to the channel. It means you'll never ever miss what is coming up real soon.